Salutations, my people. You're watching ARTV. My name is Tay Chaplin, content creator, AV God, Social Supreme, and this is Bands with Tay. Let's get it! Yeah, so apparently the animal kingdom is trying to kill all of humankind. I think this is like animal, what's the name of that movie? With the apes. Planet of the Apes. This is like Planet of the Apes all over again. <laughs> In the jungle, the mighty jungle, where snakes are eating males. Not like males, but like males, bro. Like snakes are eating like males. Like monkeys are cutting away males like bear cash. Fam, let me tell you something. We need to go to Wakanda. I need like a heart-shaped herb. I need to like talk to these like animals. Because like Black Panther can talk to animals, right? No, he can't. But let's, let's just say you can. Like, talk to all the animals and be like, yo, just like go to anybody's house, steal like their jewelry, you know, steal like 5,000 naira, let's go to Black Bell and like ball out. Yo, this is crazy. The fact that grown men are talking about animals stealing money is infuriating, but also the actual definition of why I love Nigeria so much. Listen, guys, um, what do I have to say about this monkey issue? A monkey stole 70 million naira from a farm somewhere in Nigeria, and this is headline news. The memes, everything is pouring out. Um, the fact is, someone needs to get David Attenborough on the phone. Let's get some Nat Geo out down here. Let's go through the bush and explore because, man, next thing you know, you say fish have stole uh, 50 million naira from the aquarium. 50 shades freed? 50 shades freed? Anybody? Nope. All right, moving on. Breaking news, Stormzy has just signed a new record deal with um, Deeper Life Records. Um, he has been performing Christian songs around the country, including at the Brits a week ago, where he was performing while water was pouring on him, like Port Harcourt rain, right? Now, um, I would like to state the fact that if that ever happened in Nigeria, there would be the case of electrocution first, because that mic was like waterproof, because you could hear him like clearly. Now, secondly, while he was performing, he had a choir behind him, but he put a twist on it. Everybody was wearing a ski mask. Shout out to you, Stormzy. Ooh, also, Kendrick Lamar performed at the bridge, too. Um, he performed this song called Big Shot, mixed with Ice Freezer. Cool? Cool Freezer? It's a song by one of these, like, little guys. Um, I think his name is, like, Rich the Kid, right? And it was a fascinating performance. First of all, he was on top of a big box, and inside the box, there was a Lamborghini. And, like, inside the box as well was Rich the Kid with a bat. Do you know what he was doing with the bats? He was smashing this Lamborghini, right? And he was like, oh, this is a Kendrick Lamar, like, satire. I'm like, oh, now get money. Money. Mike Chick 2 4 with a beater. Two seater. Pull a drop top with a eater. I don't need a. Anyway, that's Kendrick Lamar always doing, always on his A game. Um, shout out to the Brits, man. Um, I, I think they're trying to, like, match it up to the VMAs and like, the Grammys and everything, because, like, the UK, I think they have the Brits, they have the Enemy Award, and then the Mobos, right? Mobos. So, yeah. Good award show. Good award show. I really liked it. A huge congratulations to David Doe and his hit song, If, which has gone platinum. And we're not talking about, like, Alaba platinum, right? We're talking about, like, RIAA platinum, like abroad, right? Um, how did this happen? He just made music, and it just happened. Congratulations, Davido. Now, the only thing I would say, David, is please, would you do an album with WizKid? It sounds so crazy right now, but I think in the near future, um, we are going to have to need it because, yeah, I think, I think it's a good look. You know, similar as like Fino and... Um, Alamide, yeah, yeah, similar to Fino Alamide, like the Two Kings, Two Kings project, that was really strong. All right, guys, so if by any chance you see me sweating right now, it's because I was just watching the new Tiwa Savage video. It's called Get It Now. I know you want me. I know you really want me, yeah. I know you want me. Ah. You probably don't want to watch with your mom. Um, <laughs> it's a really nice video. Tiwa Savage is a very, very sexy human being. But one thing I would have to say is that Tua Savage also makes very, very quality music. I have to give it up to her because the fact is, you know, she signed with Maven, 
And I personally thought that that would kind of dilute her brand, but it's only made it stronger. Um, it's a really nice song. And um, I really like, um, you know, when she's on the treadmill, um, I, like, I like the shots that Meiji got. It was, it was really of the, thre of the treadmill, of the, uh, what's that? Uh. <laughs> yes, yeah, it's, it's a really dope video. Um, what, other, what other new videos came out this week? Ooh, Science Student has dropped. Listen. When I tell you that Olamide is on fire, like after, after war and then science students, like he's, I think like he's having the best year. Personally, that's what I think. Now, apparently this video was directed by Kathy. Kathy, right? I love Kathy because Kathy is a dancer and a dancer and a dancer first, right? The fact that she directed this video, if you watch the video, excuse me, I'm going to go, uh, oh. When you see the video, you can see her influence all over it. It has this, um, <laughs> you know, I was talking to Ali and she was like, oh, it has that Who Run The World Girls vibe. The name of the song is Who Run The World, right? By Beyonce, right? But it definitely has that Who Run The World Girls vibe. It's, um, it's, it's amazing. Lambda has like a mask on. Everyone is just like doing the shaku. The problem is that I don't know which way my hand is supposed to go, right? When I'm doing it. Is it like... Someone needs to explain to me, do you know what? If you know how to do the shackle properly, right? Just follow ARTV, Aristocrats TV, follow Tay Chaplin, and just like leave us like a little message, like at the bottom of the video. You know, probably gonna cut this out and put it on Instagram. And like teach me how to do shackle, please. Cause like this is a dance that, you know, I'm gonna I'm gonna try it. But if you laugh, monkey will come and eat your salary. Just know that one shot. Um, but the fact is. The Shaku Shaku is taking over, is the new dance, right? So in Nigeria, nah, I mean, let's talk about some of the dances that we've had. We've had Shaku Shaku, we've had Shoki, we've had uh, Skelewu, we've had Alanta, we have Demo, we have um, Shoki Tibobo, we have Galala, we have Yawuze. There's like so much to mention and it is not even, it's an understatement to say that we like to dance. This is very true. But I'm seeing something happening now. At the same time Shaku is coming up, the Nguam, I don't know how to pronounce it, but it's spelled G-Q-O-M, and it's the new South African vibe. If you don't know, um, that's the song that Pato Ranking was all called Available. It was produced by a South African DJ, and that's like the vibe that they're rolling on now. It's kind of similar to our Shaku vibe as well. Um, it's a movement. I'm really feeling it. Um, one thing I would like to say is that as a Nigerian, I am very, very proud of this movement. Um, the fact that we're always like reinventing and innovating and doing like dope stuff, creating new dances, it's amazing. I really don't know where it came from. Maybe Shaku came from South Africa or like his vice versa, but it's very, very similar. This is very, very similar stuff. Um, if you want to see me Shaku, um, I need like at least 10,000 10, views on this video. So um, I don't look stupid. Um, but yeah, so if you want to go listen to some of the songs um, uh, on that Shaku, can you tell me some Shaku songs? Actually, no. I think maybe I will do that for the playlist for it. That is a good idea. I'll do that for playlist for it. But for the Nguam, um, we have a song called Okobiloko. No. Kokolo. What? How does it go? Kobisiko. Kobisiko. Hey. Hey. Hey! You see, like, <laughs> you think, let me say the problem with my shaku. Yeah, you're a madman. The problem with my shaku is that, like, I literally, like, fly from left to right. You know, so some people, like, they do it stuff. Me, I'm just like. <laughs> Anyhow. Anyhow. <laughs> but, but when you're dancing, no one is really, like, looking at you. You know? <laughs> it's just like, oh, I remember, like, there was one time I was at, um, I was at Baba last week, and we were all dancing, right? So everyone's doing their, you know, doing their, you know, you do the head. Then I jumped in the middle. I wasn't trying to, but then everybody was just like, oh, and then they turned on me. And then I literally felt pieces. I was just like, <laughs> I was doing like shaking in the middle. It was, it was, uh, it was, uh, I had some shots afterward. That was fine. All right, guys, this is the third segment of our show where we pick music to fit your vibe, mood, any kind of situation that you're in. And it's called Playlist 4. Today, our playlist for 
is nothing but the playlist for Shaq. The dance that is taking over the nations. That has to be moving from left to the right, to the left, to the right, to the left, to the... Okay, so I'm messing it up now. But yeah, so basically, playlist for Shaku Shaku. Number one, I'll have to say Leg Beg Beg, right? Um, my friend got married last week. It was a joyous occasion. Happy married life, Sadiq. I love you very much. But the main problem is that they now give them that Leg Beg Beg song. It's like iPhone 1, Leg Beg Beg. Yeah. iPhone, iPhone 2, Leg Beg Beg. So we're all giving them. I think that was like iPhone 9. I was like, it has not come out. There's no iPhone 9. <laughs> Like, <laughs> but like the song says, it's lit though. One thing about like the Shaku Shaku dance here is that it's similar to um, Atlanta, where it's like you can't really have like a sane face when you're doing it. You almost have to like, it's like, you have to like, right? Sorry. <laughs> Yo, somebody get me out of here. So number one, Goes to Leg Beg Beg. Number two on the list is DJ Prince, not D Prince. DJ Prince with my guy Skills. This song is amazing. Look, I'm a beat guy, right? I'm a producer. So at first, you just hear the beats. The beats is just like, it is compelling you to move. Like, I cannot even lie, it's compelling you to move. And there's something about Skills' voice. Look, guys, I'll just tell you this, right? I'm a Skills fan, right? I met him. That guy's a lovely guy. I think he makes like, Amazing music. Oh, shout out to Scales. Um, Shaku Shaku is number two. Playlist four. All right, guys. So number three, I'm definitely just going to give it to Alamide. Come on, man. After he did, first of all, he did a dance video for Science Students. Did you see the dance video? Man. Dance video lit on fire. Flawless execution. Flawless killing them. Need to hashtag women giving them feminism hashtag all the times. And then he dropped the video. The whole world is going crazy. Olamide, I have to say something. You have proven me wrong time and time and time and time. The fact is, I believe Olamide is GOAT, yo. He's definitely GOAT. He's one of them greatest of all time. You understand? Like, um, I remember hearing about Olamide when, um, just right after the Green passed. Right? And they had like very similar vibes. He was really hip hop -y then. I understand like his, the trajectory and why he's moved towards there because it's like, it's definitely more commercial, but he definitely still holds his own on mic. Man, allow me to shout out to you, man. You're definitely a GOAT. Guys, I am just going to be very honest with you. The thing about Shaku Shaku songs is that it gets, you will not even know the name of the person that sang the song. I see a lot of Ido West. I see a lot of Alami Day. I see Mr. Real popping up like like often right and these guys they seem like to be the ones like riding the wave but normally i know that the thing probably started in one hood like somewhere right that's how the dances always start it starts from like one area and then it just like you know takes over spreads out um honorable mentions i would say it's a goal i would also say hey. oh my god oh my god forgive me um how do you say it again Shekpeteri. Shekpet. Every time I hear these songs, I'm drunk. I'll be lit. So I don't even remember the names. I just remember that, you know, you give them one hand, then you give them a cup like this, then like this, you know? And then now give them the, ooh! Guys, so the dance for the gum one is the guara guara, which is like, you're like, you know, you're going like that. It's like, a, you know, like you're passing currents. It's cool, it's pass current. Check this out. <laughs> Alright guys, that has been the playlist for Shaku Shaku. I hope you enjoy your day. I hope you enjoy your week. I hope you win your day. I hope you get everything you want. My name is Tay Chaplin and this has been Bans with Tay. You're watching ARTV signing off.